Hi guys, it's Anna from CCBC Japan uh, and I have a question for you guys. What is the thing you want most in your life? Recently, I've been thinking about um, just progressing in life, I guess, and um, just moving forward and how our life is going to be like, especially as the pandemic is um, ending, hopefully. God is going to come back soon too. But um, Psalms 63 really spoke to me recently and I wanted to share this with you guys because I'm sure all of you guys are thinking about the future, right? And what you want to strive for. Uh, Psalms 63 verse 3 says, Your unfailing love is better than life itself. How I praise you. I will praise you as long as I live, lifting up my hands to you in prayer. You satisfy me more than the richest feast. I will praise you with songs of joy. And that was from the NLT. I know CCBC um, students really love the New King James Version, but I've been um, studying um, the NLT recently because it's a new translation for me and I really enjoy how um, just like reading in another translation it really opens your eyes to what you're reading uh, more because you've just you're so used to maybe the Bible translation you've always had right and um, this verse really struck me right your unfailing love God's unfailing love is better than life itself what is better than life itself have you ever thought that there's one thing that you would give up your whole life for right what could be so good and god says right through the psalmist's heart um that life um really if there's only god's love in it um it's it's worth living and it really struck struck something with me right i was like thinking about that wow like i want so many things in life right i imagine my future right i think about um our time here at ccbc japan and the discipleship we all receive from the people in our church and um, our leaders around us and also the discipleship uh, i give as an intern to um, the students and um i i just think about yeah like our life and um just how it will progress um, later on and what vision I have for the Bible College and the ministry here. And um, this verse really encouraged me um, to look to the Lord and to really evaluate what I want in life. Like, And God says, if only my love um, is in your life, that's enough. And I really want to come to that point where I can truly agree with the psalmist, right, the psalmist and say, um, really all I want is um, to be um, in God's presence, right? And just to praise Him and um, to be satisfied by just His presence. And I want to encourage you guys, if you have really evaluated kind of your life and think like, oh man, what is next, right? What job am I going to have next? Or um, what studies am I going to do next? Or what will I strive for? Um, read Psalm 63 and really ponder on the thing that God's love is so incredible and so great for us that it's all we need and it will sustain us. It will satisfy us. So if you feel a lack, if you feel discouraged because you're striving for things and you can't reach them, that is because it's not God's love. And the only thing that can satisfy you for life is God's love. Really want to encourage you uh, today to look to the Lord and um, look to the Lord with faith and expectancy and ask him for his love to fill you and uh, whatever you're struggling with whatever um, goal you have in life will become very small compared to the love that God has for you um, in that uh, in that sense I want to um, yeah just encourage you um, to look to the Lord God bless you guys